Man plugs PS4 to airport monitor. Plays game until officials intervene in the USA. Man traveling through the Portland International Airport in the U.S. took over an airport monitor displaying airport's map and plugged in PlayStation 4 to play Apex Legends earlier this week. On being interrupted by airport officials, he requested them to let him finish the game but was denied permission. The incident didn't result in any confiscation, dispute or arrest. EVs will be cheaper than regular cars a misconception. Maruti Suzuki Exec Maruti Suzuki India's Executive Director Shashank Srivastava at a recent event by The Economic Times said, It is a misconception that electric vehicles will come at a lower cost. He added, HEV, PHEV provides scales for EV component manufacturing, business case viability for, make in India, and bring down the cost of EV in the long term this year. YouTuber says he faked broken ankle for free business class upgrade. Criticized YouTuber and Instagram influencer Jamie Zhu was criticized after he posted a video of himself faking a broken ankle to get his economy class flight seat successfully upgraded to business class for free. Zhu is seen limping and telling the attendants the boot for his injury doesn't fit in his seat. A user commented. The airline should ban you permanently. Apple may launch MacBook with touchscreen display. Hint's new patent A new Apple patent which has surfaced online suggests that the company may consider making a touchscreen MacBook, titled Cross-Device Interactions. The patent describes the screen as a touch-sensitive display on which the user can perform a variety of finger inputs, depending on their purpose. In 2018, Apple's senior VP of software engineering Craig Federighi had dismissed the idea. WhatsApp down in India. Users unable to send photos and voice messages Facebook-owned messaging platform WhatsApp suffered an outage in India and some other regions including Brazil, Middle East and Europe on Sunday, with users complaining they were unable to send photos videos and voice messages across the platform as your WhatsApp users started reporting the outage. After 4.00 p.m. in the evening, WhatsApp, Facebook and Instagram experienced a day-long outage in July 2019.